Oh man, Anthony Davis. One of the most unique talents in the NBA. I see a lot of myself in him. I can't wait to face him and see if I can get the upper hand. I know I'm still a rookie, but it's the ultimate test to see where my game is at right now. And I live for these moments. So bring it on, brow. Yeah, what's going on, everybody? It's your boy, iPod King Carter here. The brow did not like me calling him that, and he just dunked on my goddamn it. Bro, Anthony, what did I do to you? Like, like I thought we was cool, though. Like, what's wrong? I thought you were supposed to treat the rookies with some respect because you used to be one. God damn. Anthony Davis out here disrespecting me, man. I'm just going to have to let him know that I ain't no sucker and I ain't to be played with as I shoot the nice little leaner right there. Oh, yeah. Fade away, leaner. Freaky with it, you know what I'm saying? Freaking the vibe, and ain't that what they call it? But I like the way my teammates like to get steals, man. But yeah, he fouled me, so uh, it's time to repay him. You know, I, I I wish I had a high overall because I would have put my balls all in that man's face. You know what I'm saying? And I would have got the and one, you know. But I'm going to pay it back by hitting these free throws, man. Also, don't ask me about my routine. I'm going to go ahead and get Kevin Durant drink as soon as I get me some VC. Right now, I'm working on these attribute bars. Uh, I believe my shooting is at a 10. My defense is at a 4. My playmaking is at a 4. And my athlete, I think, is at a 6. So right now, I'm just working on my attribute bars, trying to make things better. And Davis has still been a savage out here, man. Not giving a care in the world. But before this play is over, I'm going to just let y'all know how savage I am. All these crossover cheesing between the lace to the rack, the harm, and the bucket. Let's listen to Anthony, man. And one of the rising stars in the NBA is Anthony Davis. His offensive. A lot of face up. You know, um, you know I like to do is one dribble pull up. You like to do the one dribble and fade back off one leg. I haven't got there yet, you know. Um, but, you know, catching the ball at the, at the elbow. You know, catching ball at the nail. I'm just saying that man was up there slurping, bro. I'm just, I'm just saying, hey Anthony, you good, bro? You drooling a little bit when you doing your interviews, cuz? Just saying. But it's 36, 38. We up tilt. I'm gonna go ahead and try to extend this little lead right here, giving a little bit of that Jordan Kobe slash work right here. But I'm going nowhere, man. Going lateral just does not work. But I can pull up in his face and hit some shots. You got me effed up, bro. I'm going to force it all the way. You got me chopped. Now, we down on offense once again, you know what I'm saying? Trying to see if I can get the defense on their toes. And Cole just be all up in my mid. I remember I used to have a fade like that. Check that out. Uh-huh. But you know high top fade. What's up now, huh? You better cut your hair and grow up. I'm just saying. Now, just to let everybody know something real quick, you know what I'm saying? I'm, I'm going to get back to the gameplay. My player will age. A lot of people have been asking me about my bald head. Why I'm not bald? Why do I have hair? iPod, what's wrong with you? Basically, this year I wanted to do it normally. I wanted my player to actually age. In high school, he had a high top fade. In college, he had a high top fade as well. When he got drafted, he decided, you know what? I'm getting a little too old. It's time to give up this childish thing. So now he got a regular old haircut, got his waves pocking. You know what I'm saying? Maybe one day he'll have a receding hairline. Maybe, you know, go straight to some little shaved head. You never know, man. You know what I'm saying? It's my decision. I like the choices that I've been making with this my player. Things looking good. Um, but check out that puff fake. Did y'all see how the... Oh, my. You know what? I can't even explain it, bro. Like... I've been shooting a lot of jump shots, so now that they're on their toes, I can do just about anything. Did you guys see the double team come? Remember when you used to score eight points and then the double team will automatically come? It's a little bit like that in 2K16, but it's it's more so they just key in on you, but like don't run straight up for the double team, if you know what I mean. But I'm, so far, everything's looking so good. Now, I will say this, man. They set me out for the whole fourth quarter. You know, we're still up 10, luckily, you know, because it's when I'm not in the game, teams magically score 30 to 40 points on us every time. But I want to talk to you guys about my jersey number choice. Now, everybody knows that I like wearing number 15, but DeMarcus Cousins is wearing number 15, and they did not switch his jersey when I got drafted to this team. So there may be a problem in this 2k where i will not be number 15 man um i want to go to the philadelphia 76ers everybody knows that that number is retired so there may be a problem there maybe it won't be uh choosable or something i don't know you know i'm, I'm not sure i'm totally not sure but we will see in the coming videos i promise you know but i i'm gonna I'm be mad if i don't get number 15 man i'm gonna be pissed 
I'm just saying it, man. I'm going to holler at you on the next one, man. Peace. The 2K Sports Post Game Show. Hi again, everybody. This is Ernie Johnson, joined by Shaquille O'Neal and Kenny the Jet Smith. Time now to present our Jordan player of the game, Rudy Gay. Just a monster first quarter of the game. He came out hot and just never cooled down. That boost he gave his team early on a huge factor. As slashers go, Ernie, Rudy Gay is up there with the very best. He's got freakish physical ability. You talk about a guy who plays above the rim. Rudy can soar like a ha 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 ha. He was relentless in the way he attacked tonight offensively. I love the way he constantly forced the hand of whoever was guarding him. The defender had to choose between what, letting him blow by him or then fouling him once he did blow by them. And those free throws turned into a lot of points. And that brings us to the end of our broadcast for this evening. For Kenny Smith, Shaquille O'Neal, Kevin Harlan, and our illustrious 2K Sports crew, this is Ernie Johnson saying good night. And we'll see you again soon, but not soon enough.